What's good, everybody? What's good? It's your boy, Hollywood Sports. What's good, everybody? How's everybody doing today? Man, I want to do this breakdown. Like I said, guys, I'm, I'm going to continue to do breakdowns for Madden because the game needs to improve. But you know what? I'm still going to accept Madden for Madden. I'm going to accept it, guys. But uh, these are, this is what I want to talk about right here. The game needs here. Let's just go through it and I'll show you what I'm talking about. Let me show you what I'm talking about. All right, here we go. You got Logan Thomas right there, number 82. You got Seals Jones. Both, both are, you know, Logan is our number one tight end. Seals Jones is our number two tight end. You see number two for Denver right there. And you see, what number is that? Number 21 for Denver. Now, number 21 is going to be covering, um, you know, of course the game has bad technique. But um, number 21 is covering Logan Thomas, number 82. And number two for Denver, and I don't know their names, I don't care. I was, it's covering Seals Jones, number 83. Now, watch this. Look, number two cannot cover Seals Jones because Logan Thomas is in the way, okay? Now, we're talking about uh, detection, player detection. They don't, they don't see each other out there. They don't know each other's out there. There's got to be some collision detection in this game, okay? Again, number two is covering Seals Jones, number 83, and number 21 is supposed to be caught uh, 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 on Logan Thomas. Okay, number two tries to get over there to, to, to go along with number 83, uh, Seals Jones, but he can't because Logan Thomas is in the way, correct? Okay. Now, right here, now you tell me there's no resources or technology to fix this game as far as uh you know players knowing we you know as far as knowing where each other is as far as collision detection there's technology out there for collision detection i guarantee it there is but the suits aren't giving the devs the resources to put it in the game to program it in the game that's a resource they don't have you have to go out and get something that says that helps this game with collision detection. Collision detection is probably at least 50 to 60% wrong with gameplay. Probably more than that. Collision detection is not in this game. Okay? So that leaves Logan Thomas wide open only because it was like basketball. Right? Number two was running a, running a pick right there. <laughs> he was running a pick. I mean, that number two, yeah, he was running the pick. And so number 21 couldn't get over there. There's got to be a resource for this. Collision detection, guys. Now, now we talk about AI intelligence. Now, once number two says, okay, I can't stick with Logan Thomas. I mean, I can't stick with number 83, Seals Jones, because Logan Thomas is in my way. So AI intelligence should say, okay, number two should say, okay, I'm already here. So let me stay with Logan Thomas. And number 21 should say, let me stay with Seals Jones, number 83. And it would have been easy right there when we talk about AI intelligence. Now, this is what I mean when I'm always talking about either the dev team is too small. There's one issue with, with uh, programming this game. And number two, they don't have the time to program things like this in the game. They don't really have the time to do significant significant programming to fix the gameplay and even if they had a significant time to fix the gameplay they don't have the resource to fix it the money to get the resource to fix collision detection in this game that's one resource i guarantee you they don't have and if they do have it they don't have time to fix and program the game to a significant point to improve gameplay that's why we get copy and paste they put in the new stuff in the game okay you know they what, what did they put in new in the game this year uh you know they put in home field advantage you know the squiggly lines well, on, on, on your uh on your uh, play art all those kind of new things they put in the game is all they had time to do and they didn't complete doing that so how and when are they going to have time to really work on gameplay and programming this game when are they going to have time 
to program new animations in this game. The development time is for putting in new stuff. You know, they added a lot of stuff to franchise mode. You know, you know, uh, 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 different stuff that you do on the list in franchise mode. Okay. They added that. They was also working on scouting. Okay. And that's not even out yet. So when are they going to have time to program gameplay? They don't have the time. Now, they need a bigger development team. I don't know how big it is, but it's not big enough, obviously, because they never have time. Things always get delayed. Patches don't, don't get fixed, right? The patches, they still need to fix this game. A lot of patches still haven't come out yet. Their development team is too small. And I guarantee the suits have been working on other things other than what's the priority in fixing gameplay. They should not have brought out that college, that college thing. I forgot what you call it because that shouldn't have been a priority. But they thought that college thing they put out where you can play with the college team was a priority than getting out these patches, getting out scouting, and fixing these zones. That's why I say until we get new suits up there in that tower, EA is not going to, man is not going to change. Okay? Collision, det collision detection is one of the things they need to fix this game. Look at that. Guys running into each other. Logan Thomas can't even go on his route because number two is in the way. They have no idea there's bodies around them. There has to be some kind of collision body detection in this game. All right? Now, one thing I want to say, look at this. Look at number 83. He's wide open right there. If you look at, he's wide open. He's wide open. There's nothing there here. But I was getting there. This was an online ranked match, by the way. And I was, he, he had a blitz. I saw the blitz coming, but I said, usually I get good blocking uh, uh, on that play. I can't do max protect, otherwise I can't get my tight ends going out, right? So I had a just enough time, but I was panicked to throw the ball. I threw it to Logan Thomas. I saw him breaking away. But there's there's uh, Sales Jones right there for a touchdown, but I didn't see him. But the only reason these guys are even open is because of the collision. The only reason I'm open is because of the collision, guys. Right here. Look at all that collision. Number two and, and uh, Logan Thomas, number 82. He can't get over there to cover that 83. I know I repeat myself, guys, but I'm trying to hit it home. Also, the AI intelligence is not there. Number two should have said, okay, I'm already here. Let me speak with Logan Thomas. Would have been great uh, AI intelligence to switch men. But they're programmed to stay with their guy. And that's it. Okay? I get the completion right here. So the point of this video, guys, there has to be some kind of collision detection in this game, number one, and two, they need better AI intelligence. Thanks for watching, guys, and thanks for listening. See you on my next video.